some of y'all not gonna like this, but who gives a shit, right? Because all I'm bringing is experiential facts and facts that are pretty validated by the consensus of um, women that most men deal with. And you know what, what it says right below here is what I'm gonna talk about today. And, and I won't be long winded, it's just a quick video. But the truth is, most women are allergic to the standards of men, to the standards of, to the high standards of men, that is, unless it's about money. I mean, just think about it. Most of the so called high standards that your woman has or decides that she's gonna hold herself to, where, 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 where she get them shits from? Work, school, people with money, high status, high, highly affluent people. That's usually who she's going to take cues from on what standards to adopt and which, and which ones to reject. However, if she finds herself with you, an up and coming young man, or you might be medium age, I don't know, 30s, right? We're still young when we're under 45, right? And you have these particular set of standards of which they make sense. They make great logical sense. Hmm, I see why you do that. Hmm, this makes sense. Listen, bro, shame with them shits unless you got money or you have you're highly affluent, got high status, or some superficial shit like that. The average woman, especially when you're black, uh, as a black man, she ain't trying to take your standards unless she's being paid or subsidized in order to take them. Because what's gonna happen is, if you just happen to have some standards that perhaps she wasn't taught at work, because you know she mostly got it from work and school and those other people she ain't get it from the house but if you got some standards that indicate to her that she's got to step her game up you know what she's gonna want to do she's gonna want to take those standards and step her game up on her own which she oftentimes never does all she does is take the standard of the high standard man of which she couldn't actually meet and then Apply it to the next man who she's going to date. Oh, you need to be on this level. You need to be on that level. You need to be on a level that she can't reach. <laughs> I'm sorry it sounds the way it does, but these are our true experiences. They don't want to hear shit from you unless you're affluent, you got money, or they're getting paid. She doesn't really learn a lot of these things like essential communication skills. You know, like empathy, compassion, learning how, having perspective, not just thinking about herself. She don't learn that shit at home, especially she comes from a home where mom, dad, or whomever were all primarily concerned about their damn selves. That's the standard. And listen, I get it. There are some exceptions. Women who will meet someone regardless of his financial position, and if he has something to contribute to her life, she can genuinely take it. But in most cases, women are so ego-fueled that the idea of you seeming like a superior man or one that has higher standards, and if you don't drive a nice car, if you don't, you're not on TV, if you're not this type of person, she's not gonna look at you as a person worthy of, yeah, hey, you know what, you're right. She's not gonna look at you like that. She's gonna be like, man, you just, you, I can't deal with this shit. Like, you, you asking for too much. I got this going on. I gotta work. I got life. You know what I'm saying? I got time for all of that. He want me to do this. He want me to do that. Nah, girl, I ain't got time for that shit. I'm too busy. You hear what I'm saying? I got, I, I got work to go. Well, guess what, baby? Work your fingers down to the fucking bone. And like Kevin Samuel say, die alone. Because them niggas that don't have standards don't give a fuck but to fuck you. They don't care because they're going to dismiss you anyways. All they care about is you meet that standard for those first three, four, five dates, three, four months. And then when you start slipping, you're gone. 
And it's as long as you can get dressed and look nice, you think to yourself, I can get another one. You ain't going to get another man that's going to hold you to a standard, though. And you're going to be hard-pressed to find a man who's going to be patient with you enough to help you rise or raise your standards with him. Just like most men who are on that level, just not going to find a woman that's that humble. Please, tell me I'm wrong. Am I making this shit up? I know I'm not.